Arduino NRF24L01 Keyboard and Mouse Emulator The objective of the project is remote control of 20 computers from one main computer. By control is meant the control of the keyboards and mice of these computers. For remote command transmission, let's take the NRF24L01 radio module. From the main computer side, we use the Wemos D1 mini controller based on ESP8266. We will connect Arduino Pro microcontrollers based on 80 Mega 32U4 to the rest of the computers. This controller allows you to implement a USB keyboard and mouse emulator. I have only found the 5V version of the Arduino Pro Micro. Therefore, a step-down module up to 3.3V had to be added to the circuit to power the radio module. I recommend mounting by soldering or wires or using a special board. Mounting the Arduino Pro Micro isn't very pretty due to the module's step down, but the radio connection works reliably. The finished electronic device is connected via a USB micro cable to the computer. All the commands that I needed for the project are summarized in this table. The first column contains the number of the managed computer, command codes in the second column, in the third column of the table, the actions that will be performed on remote computers. For example, to right-click on the 10th computer, enter the code P10Q21 on the main computer. To press the D key on the 7th computer, you need to enter the code P7Q4 on the main computer. The main controller program is so simple that it fits on the monitor screen. The setup contains the settings for the UART port of the controller, as well as the NRF24L01 radio module. The radio channel selection is commented out here, as its number will automatically change for each remote computer. I assign a separate channel number to each managed computer. The loop is processing commands from the port monitor. From the received command, the computer number is extracted, and this number determines the radio channel through which the action number will be sent to the remote controller. The action number is written to the CMD variable, and the computer number to the ID variable. At the end of the program, the radio module is given the channel number and the value of the CMD variable. The program for Arduino Pro microcontrollers contains the keyboard and mouse libraries to emulate the virtual keyboard and mouse of controlled computers. In the settings of each of the managed controllers, a unique radio channel number must be specified. Here, for example, the number 11 is given. In loop, the controller is waiting to receive an action number from the radio module. When a number is received, one of the prescribed commands from the keyboard or mouse library is executed. For example, when receiving code 22, the computer's mouse cursor should move 20 pixels to the right. When code 3 is received, the S key on the virtual keyboard will be pressed. Upon receipt of command 14, the caps lock key will be pressed. To repeat this project for your tasks, I recommend that you familiarize yourself with the keyboard and mouse libraries in more detail. Only some controllers from the Arduino line support work with them. Therefore, the Arduino Pro Micro was not chosen by chance. After downloading the programs to the controllers, I start the port monitor on the main computer and enter the command code P11Q1, which means 11th computer. Press the W key. Notepad is open on remote computer number 11 to demonstrate keystrokes on the keyboard.
let's also check the pressing of the right and left mouse buttons. Here the right click of the mouse worked. You can also check the mouse cursor control. Here is the left mouse click. I hope you like the project. With simple NRF 24 L01 radio modules, you can control computers at a distance of up to 100 meters, and using the same modules with amplifiers, the distance can be increased up to 1 kilometer.